Hello, this is Yellow Hobo, and we're playing Drago Noka. This is kind of like playing Nasis, which you've seen me play in the past, and playing possibly Stardew Valley, but it's more on the Nasis side, though. Besides you building relationships and stuff, so you can pick either a guy or a girl, or pick a guy. And this intro is a little weird because it tells you you had some errors, and it's uh, a little messed up. And some of you may have never heard this sound before, but uh, that's a busy signal on the internet. So, <laughs> back in dial-up days, an errors curve, we're going to blast through all this. We're just going to skip that. But it keeps on telling you an error occurred. I thought my game crashed. I was like, what's going on? But, uh, hello. I don't think we've met, have we? I don't... I know we just met, but could you lend me a hand? <laughs> This is a little sad, all right? She's uh, she's she's doing a thing for her dad, and uh, we're gonna say, you know, I'll miss you. Yeah, there you go. She wants me to assist her in pushing him off. So there you go. And that was a dragon <laughs> that we ride on the back of. I'm known of the priestess of this dragon. What's your name? We're just gonna go with the good old typical. There you go. And we're playing with a controller and keyboard. So yeah, keyboard's just uh just for typing though. Grand tortoise, which is a dragon, by the way. <laughs> It gets pretty interesting, though. And there is me a me. That's about how I've been calling her. <laughs> Dragon Association. Oh, is that so? Can't meet him if he's... Yep. Of old age, yes. It was peaceful. I'm oh, sorry to hear that. Are you alright, Miss Priestess? I'm fine. Could you explain dragons to this person? <laughs> And they're saying uh, it's an amnesiac. I don't know if I... I always picked it's true, so... Now we're going to look at uh, Grant, the Grand Tortoise. Yeah, I know. Pretty, pretty big, big old dude. Just live my life as usual. So they need they need someone uh, to actually make this place better. I'll help with the village. Yes, over the top. <laughs> Sometimes she's thankful. Uh, yeah, work. We got to rebuild the village, which I mean, you can see in some points of the game that it is. Already uh, done up. Like, uh, here, I'll use the mouse on this. Right up here. Got an axe, hammer, and our hand, I think. Or a glove. Yeah, remember to get enough rest. You do have energy on here. A is how you open the door on the. Uh... Oh, yeah. Uni, are you done? She's like our salesperson, plus she brings us uh, recruits when we want them. We're just going to skip all this, because no point, really. And you got to get big time frame to actually do everything. And the first mission is going to be put the dragon bell down. So, go up here. It took me a second to figure this out, but it's not too bad. We gotta put these two things down. So we're gonna put the dragon bell right around here. Gotta clear both grass slots to put this down. And then we're gonna go ahead and put down a shipping crate right next to it. So I don't lose it. 
There you go. You gotta check these boxes too, because your villagers gather stuff. This is where you feed people. Yeah. And then you got a building table, which was a little confusing, because I was like, how do I build the further on stuff? But you figure that out pretty easily once it comes down there. No, oh, this rock right here. You have to clear all that. Yuck. So we're going to go ahead and jump ahead just a little bit. It tells us to get wood. We're just going to pay attention to... There you go. we got to get the perfect hits. And uh, leveling up is uh, pretty quick initially. And then it slows down after like 20. Like exponentially. Oh, but yeah, if you get the perfect hits on these things, you save a little bit of energy for yourself during the day. So you can do more work. See how I'm doing 88. See 44 is my regular. Well, 46 is now my regular. I gotta slow down on my tapping whenever I do that to get perfect hits. And it's just, you know, not too bad. We're just gonna clear out the immediate area just a little bit. Uh, we can deal with some clay. Oh gosh. I forgot how bad it is using the hammer because later on you do get a pickaxe and you get a shovel which does clay a lot faster. This is clay. There you go. Oh, butterfly. I see you. Butterflies are actually kind of useful for crafting and also fishing. I have not done fishing yet, so... Yeah, we'll, we'll be learning about that later on in the series. But I do plan on playing this until, you know, I feel completely done up. Because there is fighting too, which I got into briefly, but it took four hours. Which was probably a misplay on my part. So what we're doing right now is we're just going to end up getting all these levels and build several houses just to go. Day two is here, and uh, it's always super duper bright in the morning time. I don't know if that's on purpose or not. I'm going to say it's on purpose, but I'm not 100% for sure. But we're going to go ahead and keep on cutting down trees for the remainder of this day. And then we're going to build both these houses. Probably do like a little time lapse for you. Make it, make it all nice and pretty for you. Baby, you give me ice and fire. You're giving me wind. And just like that, we got two houses up. Now we need to go find some cotton to make the beds. I think I got one, which is not enough, and we need to also cut down trees. Plus, we're a little low on stam. Yeah, so we're going to go ahead and probably recruit one today. I think you can only recruit one a day anyway, so it'll be all right. Thank you. And then recruitment. Uh, farming first. Okay. Ring the bell. Get the person here. She likes the name. Alright, now we gotta do some nice stuff for her. And we can assign her a house doing this. So you go to housing. And it's red. We're going to give her this one up here. Yep. And then we're going to give myself this one. 
There you go. Now I'm not homeless anymore. Now we just need beds. <laughs> Fun time, right? Uh, yeah. Let's see if I can even make one right now. No. We need more cotton wool. Alright, let's go find it. So the crafting's pretty easy in this game. We finally got the cotton wool. Enough for... Oh, yeah, we're almost, we almost got enough for... Uh, hey, we got some energy back too. We needed energy so we can get some wood. We got one bed. Now we need to get the other one. Should be enough wood, hopefully. Yeah. Yes, please. And she'll probably require some other things too, but that'll be like a tomorrow thing after he goes, uh, you know, go to sleep. And we got our blacksmithing up to level one. There we go. So we're going to go ahead and go to items. Wooden bed. We're just going to pop you down. I don't know, like right here. She should be a little bit happy about this. We can get requests. So she wants a table, chair, storage. We'll do that tomorrow. And then she'll give us something in return for that. Every, you know, requests and doing niceties for everybody always ends in a good way. She's going to go to sleep now. Alright, so we're going to go ahead and look at what she's bringing in here. Nothing really of note. We can get the seeds from our person now. So let's see. We got Kaya or Lauren. Wants to make a weapon someday. That's cool. Better than Blacksmith Clyde, but get the job done. I guess we'll go with a veteran. Yeah, we don't have a house for her yet, but we got plenty of wood to build a couple more houses now. Yeah, pick on us for our bad tools. Didn't really want to do that, but okay. Now, the question is, where do we want to build a house? Probably over here somewhere. And you can see we're already level 15 on our uh, lumberjacking, which isn't too bad. We can put it right here since there's not too much to clear. Yeah, it'd be a good spot right here. There we go, now we got her a bed. Let's go ahead and see if I can, or not a bed, see if I can make her somewhere to sleep at least. Yes we can, all right. Had to go to sleep a little bit in between that uh, that time frame there, so. Fun times, all right, fun times. Don't sleep on the ground, I got you. Well, didn't want to do that. There you go. Here's your bed. We'll put your wardrobe in here and make it look all nice. And a wooden box. And a table. Come on. 
There you go. You got a fully housed house now. And then we can go ahead and fully house this one too. Don't mind me. Just just been here doing work while you sleep. There you go. Now you can have visitors over and everything. Can put a wardrobe in here too, just in case. We'll talk to them in the morning and get our rewards from them. Now it's time to go see what we get from doing all this. Man, I'm going to remove these rocks. <laughs> Need to remove them. There you go. She gave me a shovel. She's talking about sharpening it, but as far as I can tell, there's no... There's no... What you would call it on there? And then you can talk and get more information out of them. She said, there's no secret to blacksmithing. And now she's going to request a work table. We can gladly make one. And then we're going to go up here and talk to the other one so we can get them all bunched together. Yes. And what do we give? I forget what we give it in this one. Planting, I think. So water can. Yeah. Ho. Oh. And some planting stuff. I think I'm going to put it right beside her. We're going to go ahead and get Quilt into this. And, yeah, we're going to have to rush and build her house too. But we're also going to get a tailor machine up. She's a she's a sewer, so we can uh, definitely get her, uh, get her in here. Come on. There you go. I don't know what the delay on that is all about, but I don't like it. Uh, we need the spinning wheel first before we make the bed. And then we're probably going to have to find some of the... Uh-oh. Emergency! Yep. Got an emergency. It's not that big of a deal, though. It's a water dragon. Uh, every dragon around actually affects everything. You don't want to be around the demonic dragon at all. <laughs> or the ice dragon. So we're just going to go ahead and let you know about that. There you go. Alright, so we got a sewing table. We just need to actually get her a house up. And this will give us a... I'm pretty sure it gives us a... What is it called, man? Where do I want to put her at? We did clear this out. This would be the ideal spot. She don't need too big of a house, so we're going to go ahead and get that built. If I can. I don't know how much wood I got. We don't have enough wood. Uh, oh, yep, time to clear some more. Maybe you give me ice and fire. You're chilling when the rain. Yes, I'm gonna put a fly. Baby, you give me a bit that I. You whip up my appetite. So another house complete, but we don't have enough to make a bed, and I think we're going to have to sleep to get some of the cottontails to spawn up, like you just seen these plants do. Yeah. So. Because I don't see any. Oh, I see one over there. And a new plant that you can just jump over, I'm pretty sure. We need one more, though, and it's right over here, if I can get to it. Yes. Now we can make this for her. And we got the spinning wheel in advance to, you know, make it a little nicer. We won't be leaving the houses barren like that. We'll be putting windows and stuff on them as, as we go. Just need clay. I don't know what I'm doing in here with you. I need to go here. And yeah, make you a wooden bed.
There you go. And we're going to go to sleep after we put this down. There, you can have a wood box right here. Table and chair. Alright, cool. We'll get that done in the morning time. Alright, so it's time to actually make something a little bit more advanced this time around. We got the work table, we got the spinning. So we need to put the table down, and this is just all to make her happy. And one chair. Oh, we already had a table, huh? There you go. I don't know where she's at, so... Alright, and then she's here as well. But we'll, we'll get our reward from her. I think she gets us a pickaxe, to be honest with you. Taylor giving me a pickaxe. Pickaxe doesn't make any sense, but it is what it is. Um, we're going to go ahead and put the work table right here. There you go. You should be happy now. Earthen house and clay. There you go. We can talk some more. <laughs> and the over top action again. Uh, funny, funny. Yeah, the furnace is going to take me a second. That's going to require me to get the pickaxe. And I don't know where the lady is to get the pickaxe from, so we're going to have to figure that one out. She gives you, you free music tracks every day as well. I don't think I'm ready to recruit just yet. The next one should be the uh, tamer. Yeah, rancher. Got Annie. Or him. Uh, let's see here. Are you back in your house yet? Nope. Not in here. So you gotta be out here somewhere. Nope. Is that you over there? No. Oh, cotton, though. No. Let's get the cotton. We need all of it. And yeah, you can just smack it, too. Sometimes I smack it. Sometimes I just pick it up like a regular person. There you go. Now, I think you let them sit for a second. I didn't mean to push her around. <laughs> So, she's either in my house, which would be weird, or she's somewhere else. Because I don't see her. Oh, there she is. Alright. You're welcome. Gave me that pickaxe. Just skip through all that. And she wants a spinning wheel, which we already have made. We're going to move her away from this person. And you need a seed bag pile, which is going to work out well with the spinning wheel, because you can make it there. But we don't have enough to actually do that just yet. We're in a fire and water influence, which is, uh, I'm going to say it's probably bad, but, uh, at least we got the water to combat the fire. Ooh. So hopefully we don't have too many problems out of this. We can get my pickaxe leveled up a little bit. It's only level three, but... We need to make a furnace. So we're probably going to end up doing that real quick. And this one, you uh, making special, I believe? No. We ain't got the unlocked yet. So we got to unlock something else. We need to make a seed bag. We almost got enough to make the fertilizer bag that we're going to need next. But we don't have any animals yet anyways. I didn't opt to buy any. Not too big of a deal. So we're going to go ahead and talk to you. Oh, wait a minute. I got to put it down first. <laughs> Silly me. There you go. And you're happy. You're welcome. Water capacity. Yeah, that's right. I'm about to get into farming too. The quilt gave me a furnace. <laughs> so now I can make a furnace. Well, maybe I can make a furnace. Maybe not. Uh, but they're all intertwined together how everything works. It's pretty cool. I uh, know. Special furnace. Yes, we can make it too. So just gotta play this place this down in uh what is her name? Toya? I think her name's Toya. I could be wrong though. I'm probably wrong. Man, my water steaming, that's probably not good. There you go. Let's go ahead and Oh, didn't mean to hit you. <laughs> Whoopsie. 
stone house and path. There you go. Now, what do you want me to make? I think it's a blast furnace, right? Stone cutting table. Oh, that's easy enough. I think I'll make the here. Yeah. So you can see we're getting a little bit further into the crafting now. Not too shabby. And it took me significantly less time to do it this time around though, which is nice. Always nice to do it faster. You know what? Right there. Yeah, look at all that stuff. Excavation drill, that's what we're talking about. These take a little bit of time, but we're going to go underground, so that'll be cool. The delivery wyvern too. Go get my free music for the day. Hmm. I don't think I've heard of that one yet. Let's go ahead and I'll show you what these music things are. You can set them up too. So we got Serato. That's what's playing. Hataru. This one I have not heard. Huh. Make this at night time. I don't like teeth. Dude, that's epic right there. We'll do that one. They put a lot of time into the music. If you can't hear it, uh, it looks like you can. Nice. We'll leave those playing for a second. They changed throughout the day, so not too bad. Uh, requirements. We don't have any of their requirements, huh? Dang. Alright, what's your requirement? Nope. Uh, and you do want to get your people leveled up, so instead of me making it, I should let them make it. Just because it benefits me in the long run, so whenever I don't want to make something, they can make it. And they can get buffs out of it and stuff like that. Tanning table. We can do, probably do that. But probably, I mean, not. Uh, where do we make it at again? I forget. Not here. got deal in here now that's how I'm gonna call him at least and uh, he gave us some free eggs and now he's asking for a feed box probably yeah now we're getting into the animal portion of this and now we got to go over here I think the feed box is out of you yes it is make one of these I need to quit doing that cuz I need to let her do it Ooh, butterfly Come here, butterfly. Thank you. And put a feed box somewhere around here. I wonder... I feel like it's just a waste being inside, but I guess I'll put all the animals right here. Gave me a rope. It's got an interesting take on uh, animals, though. taxidermy mount. I can't quite do that yet. 
You know what we're gonna do though? We're gonna put these eggs down. Got one each. And one of them give hides, the other one does not, uh, just gives poo poo. So we're all right with that. All right, before you go to sleep, egg shop. We got enough to get a, get most of these. There you go. And we want to keep them kind of out of the way because they block your walking. Oh, wait a minute. We still got one more. And I can fill this up with uh, the feed trough with with goodies. Where did I put there? I put you. There you go. Just fill it up with grass. There you go. Now it's time for bed. So we already got two of these farm animals hatched. That's good. Gonna move you out the way so I can get this one. And hopefully he takes care of them. That's the hope at least. Nothing yet. You were you just moved in though. So we gotta go around and check all these good old storage units. Like that. I just got a flower planter for free. Stone rubble earthen table for free. Perfect. What do you need again? Anvil. Right, right, right. We need to go down to the mine whenever it's done cooking up. What else do we need over here? Kitchen knife would be good for, you know, cooking. <laughs> That's about it, though. All right, so... We got things queued up, mating, making in the moment right now, and wyvern persons come over here. We're gonna get our last thing for the day, the waltz. Those are pretty expensive, actually. Uh, and we are getting her tanning table made up right now, and then on top of that, whoa. You just teleport over here? Yeah, we, we good on eggs right now. We're going to be so deep in it here pretty soon. Tax staring them out. That's made here, but I don't think I can make it just yet. Oh no, it's on the tanning table. Right, right, right. So whenever they get the tanning table done. Which they might have already. No, she's still making it. My bad. But anyways, uh, this is a good spot to call it here. Hope you enjoyed watching the video. Let me know down in the comments what you think about this game. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe, and I'll see you on the next one, everybody. Have a great day, man. Goodbye.